Everybody likes me. Banana. Okay, guys. Um, well, you probably figured out what we're going to do today. I'm going to show you how to make frozen turtle bananas. I thought this would be a good time to get this summertime treat in before the summer's over. Alrighty, so um, grab your ingredients and let's get started. See you guys soon. Bye. First off, we're going to start with a bag of white Wilton's candy melts. Okay, throw them in the bowl. Okay, so we got a bowl of candy melts. Now we're going to microwave this candy melts chocolate for about a minute, and then I'll be right back. Okay, so now we have the melted candy now melts. Now we're going to add about two teaspoons of shortening two teaspoons of shortening to the candy melts and then mix everything together. Okay, so we are back and here is the melted candy melts mixed with the shortening and just want to show you the consistency a little bit. So we're going to do we half go. of a banana. So let's cut this banana in half. Okay, guys. So um, grab the banana, the candy mix mixture, and just place the banana in the mixture here and coat that banana. Now this is, um, you can also use candy melts with cake balls. It's really good with cake balls. I've done a cake ball video and I will put the link um, somewhere here where you can click on that Valentine's cake balls I made that around Valentine's Day but you can use these candy melts for the for that as well okay and let's try to take the banana out of that like that and let's sprinkle on some pecans. Now we have to get the syrup, caramel syrup, and the okay. chocolate syrup. And just pour that right on top, slowly. Now, um, guys, I'm going to do two more, and I will be right back, okay? And there you have it. Yes. After you put the toppings on, then you place the bananas in the freezer for four hours. And after four hours, check on it. It should be nice. The, the candy melt should have hardened perfectly. And all the toppings are hardened and everything. And Which it is, is on good top to of go. wax paper, on top of like a wire rack. It's a cooling cookie rack here. But just get an idea of what the bananas look like before and I will have some after photos later on. Okay. Alright guys, so that's it. That's how you make the frozen turtle bananas. I hope this video was very helpful for you. Very helpful for you. And if you like my videos and you want to see more and you haven't already, please subscribe. Button's right there. And um, also if you have any requests, comments, leave them down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Alright? Cooking and kisses. Bye.